So let's dive right into it. You are an avid animal lover. You have your own charity called The Fluff Ball. Tell us a little bit about that. Tell us about Bunny. How, how does all of that tie in together? Uh, so I founded The Fluff Ball in 2010. And um, it started as a little, you know, fundraiser at my house. I wanted to do something to give back and, you know, and figure out what it was that I was passionate about. And, and obviously for me, it's animals. So I chose a charity and raised funds that year for Best Friends Animal Society and, and for the next couple of years after that. And then I decided, like, you know, I wanted to be able to help different charities throughout, you know, uh, throughout the years. So every year we pick a different, every couple of years, we pick a different charity to support. Um, and uh, we throw a fundraiser and we do stuff online as well. But, you know, usually it's like a cocktail event every year. The last couple of years we were, we haven't done it. There's been lots of stuff, people having babies and, you know, getting married and all this stuff. Um, this year we were planning on throwing one and then, well, <laughs> here we are <laughs> in a lockdown sort of situation so the joys of 2020 yeah yes Absolutely. yes 2020 happened and and so you know so we shifted our focus more to online fundraising and uh, we've done everything from you know raising uh, raising awareness for the animal hope and wellness foundation which deals with a lot of abuse cases as well as the dog meat trade in china Forgotten Horse Rescue, which deals with, you know, horses going to auction and being sold from, you know, to the meat trucks and rescuing them from abusive situations and things like that. And um, this year we were going to be supporting uh, Special Spirit, which helps, um, it ties in sort of animals and kids and people like they work with, they rescue horses, dogs, sheep, chickens, all kinds of things. They have a farm and, uh, and they work with veterans, um, you know, substance abuse, um, you know, recovery, uh, that sort of thing. And, um, and autistic kids and that's mm -hmm. all. So they kind of run the gamut and it brought the two worlds that I wanted to really, uh, have mesh together, you know, come together. So special spirit was like a perfect charity for that. That's fantastic.